Cubs hosting the Brewers, and the Brewers are minus 116 on the money line. The Cubs are minus 102. The over-under is 8.5 runs. The Brewers laying a run and a half on the run line are plus 134, meaning if you bet them that way, they must win by two or more. And the Cubs getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 162, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. If they lose by one, you win. The weather is supposed to be 74 degrees, 6 mile an hour winds blowing in, and a 3% chance of rain. Myers pitched twice against the Cubs this year. Six innings, three runs, three earned. They lost 5-3. He struck out six. Three innings, four runs, four earned. They lost 6-5. In Chicago, he struck out two. Assad pitched once against the Brewers this year. Six shutout innings. They won that game 5-0. He struck out four. Head-to-head, -head, the Brewers are 6-4. and four. The home team, 7-3. and three. The underdog is 6-4 and four on the money line. And the underdog getting a run and a half on the run line is 7-3. and three. There's only been one one run game in their last 10. The over is 5-4-1. and one, And the under eight is 6-4. and four. The Brewers are 3-2 and two in Myers' last five starts. The over is 2-1-2 two, and two in his last five starts. Six innings pitched, 5.6 hits, 1.6 earned runs, 5.2 strikeouts, 1.2 walks, 0.4 home runs, 90.8 pitches per game, 14.6 pitches per inning. The Cubs are 1-4 in Assad's last five starts. They've lost his last three starts. And the over is 3-2. Four and a third innings pitch, 6.2 hits, three earned runs, 3.6 strikeouts, 1.8 walks, 1.2 home runs. He's given up two home runs in his back-to-back -back starts, 81.6 pitches per game, and 18.7 pitches per inning. The Brewers are on a three-game winning streak. They're three and one in their last four. 11 runs, 12 runs, 12 runs, and then 15 runs. Five runs and a loss, nine runs and a win, eight runs and a win, eight runs and a win. For the, uh, for the Cubs, they're two and two in their last four, six and four in their last ten. 11 runs, 7 runs, 3 runs, 3 runs. 8 runs and a win, 2 runs and a loss, shut out and a loss, 2 runs and a win. I'm going with the Cubs here. Assad pitched well, Myers struggled against the Cubs, so we'll see if it's just one pitcher struggling against the team. Cubs with the money line, Cubs getting the runs. Uh, I'm going to go under. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.